not waterproof the moment you sweat it is gone it's not there it's gone these two are so identical that they almost are sisters hi guys welcome to my channel welcome to a sunscreen review video god i am a sunscreen freak and today i am going to show you another sunscreen of my favorites and uh, yeah without any further ado let's get started so today i am going to talk about this ecologica okay this ecologica sunscreen uh this is their radiance plus sunscreen and god like i have so many things to talk about this sunscreen like how it is my you know favorite sunscreen like yeah one of the favorite sunscreens and uh, why this is so innovative and the texture is something that to die for and yeah i'm gonna talk about my personal experience and the ingredient lists and i'm gonna compare it with a few other sunscreen that i like to you know tell you and yeah let's do everything First, start with the texture the texture is something that should be appraised by everyone and uh, you know i i i want to quickly tell you one thing in a most of the asian countries uh, in japan and korea the sunscreen are so lightweight that they are there like that is not a sunscreen but that is their second skin and the sunscreen are like super runny in texture like they are mostly chemical sunscreen and uh, yeah this is the category of most of the asian sunscreens that kind of that particular category of sunscreen were not available in india till you know two years ago but uh, in two years like our market strategy has totally changed brands are understanding that people are freaking about korean brands korean products so we need to you know uh, take them seriously and start appraising their formulation so yeah this is this beautiful so before when i didn't have even a youtube channel i was you know so crazy for sunscreens because my skin you know burn in instantly so i used to watch like many asian girls are reviewing sunscreen and i saw a japanese brand you know a nivea uh, water gel sunscreen something kind of I, i'll show you the image over here and the texture it is like a serum it is not it is not a sunscreen it is a serum and i used to get so obsessed with the sunscreen that you know i god like i really want to try the sunscreen but if i really wanted to try the sunscreen i need to pay like extra too much because the, the sunscreen is not available in india still now like in that date it is not available in india but i'm not obsessed with the sunscreen at all right now because i found something like this ecological radiance plus sunscreen is so like this is a dupe uh, i could say this is a dupe of the Nivea sunscreen I mean not the ingredient list obviously but the texture and when I saw like the youtubers were like applying the sunscreen like this and the sunscreen got like invisible in no time because that it was that you know skin like sunscreen it was not a sunscreen but it was like a moisturizer like not even a moisturizer like it was water like they are applied they were applying water and I used to so you know invade them like god they can use something so you know beautiful on their skin uh, but i'm totally fine right now like i'm not obsessed with the sunscreen at all right now i'm obsessed with first analyze the ingredient list and i like to analyze the ingredient list first so this is an aqua based sunscreen and uh, they are saying that they are using a water lock technology in their formulation and trust me yes it is water lock based next ingredient is suncat de that protects against uva uvb and a blue rays yes this sunscreen protects from blue blue lights you can like enjoyably now use your mobile phone and face the screens uh, then it has glycerin starch uh, then some chemical filters okay this formulation is mineral based like this is a hybrid sunscreen so it has both mineral and physical filters then it has parasol tx which protects against sun tanning and this is a zinc oxide like this is a zinc oxide category so that's why it is a hybrid sunscreen then it has aloe extracts uh, some other sunscreen filters niacinamide and niacinamide improves skin texture like there are thousands of benefits of niacinamide and this is a star of like niacinamide is a star in ingredient list obviously it minimizes the pores the appearance of pores it kind of hydrates skin fades away acne marks and whatnot like niacinamide is best for oily skin girls like and boys like niacinamide is a star ingredient it has watermelon extracts okay watermelon is a really like it is an amazing hydrating ingredient 
but the watermelon we consume it like you are eating watermelon and next you are pissing because it is mostly water and we don't get that much antioxidant benefits from watermelon that we eat uh, generally so if you if you get a product that has a watermelon in it like this is really great because now your body like it can perform as an antioxidant on your face because uh, by eating watermelon isn't that effective because yeah you are eating watermelon and next you are pissing like it is that fast process watermelon is excellent antioxidant so there are like international brands dedicating their range in watermelon i know you know that right and there are no such indian brands that are uh, formulating their products uh, with watermelon on this is like the first ever sunscreen that has watermelon in it and i think dot and key has launched their watermelon line yeah watermelon is a great antioxidant and we like literally need antioxidant for us because whenever we see sun rays or we eat something uh, our body tends to produce oxidants uh, it, they, like this is a really natural formula no matter what we eat our body tends to produce oxidants and we need antioxidant to tackle them otherwise you're gonna you're gonna look old whatever you are using on your face it is not gonna show results we really need antioxidant on your face and it is rich with antioxidants. It has tocopherol acid which is vitamin E, uh, some uh, preservative, uh, some soothing ingredients and yeah hyaluronic acid that's it. It has no sulfates, no parabens, no mineral oil. It has unique water lock technology. It is dermatologically tested. It's cruelty free. It's vegan and yeah the texture is awesome. Like what else do you want guys? Like it has everything. Now let's talk about how I like to use it as the texture is something to die for i do not use too many layers in the morning obviously i use this uh Pepteronic serum it is hyaluronic acid based serum and next i use this and yeah i'm fine like this is my morning skincare routine and i reapply this sunscreen in lunch time so yeah they are clearly saying here that after using it uh, you need to reapply it after six hours never do that if you are directly facing the sun and if you are under the sun all the day you need to reapply it within two hours the texture is so smooth so skin like that you can reapply it over and over again and it won't give you any kind of peeling any kind of oiliness any kind of any kind of annoyingness because this texture is so good your skin can penetrate uv rays from windows and from light so that's why you need to apply sunscreen even if you are indoors you don't want to look old right so yeah apply your sunscreen so i use it at 9 a.m in the morning and next i use it at 2 p.m at lunch time like after i i took i take my lunch and then i use it and i do not face sun that much when i am in my room yeah that's why this this is the two time that i like to use this sunscreen. but if i am going outside god like i reapply it in every two and two to three hours this is not the only sunscreen that I come across. Um, I tried a Cologica a Glow Plus sunscreen, and I must say that the more like the difference, the main difference between these two is uh, their texture. Well, this one is more like emollient based, whereas this one is more like water based. Like this sunscreen is somewhere between a serum sunscreen and a gel sunscreen. This is awesome in texture whereas this one is more like in creams between a cream sunscreen and a gel sunscreen so i think this would be perfect for summer uh, i mean winter times as it is more emollient based but this is perfect for winter days like i have purchased one more of it and i like after finishing this bottle i'm gonna save the bottle for my summer days because i wanna like truly experience this on summer times I think this thing I mentioned it in my Instagram story that if you ever if you have ever used this blessing tree sunscreen lotion then you might know that the, the, the feeling and the smell is so though it is fragrance free but the feeling the smell is so similar like in this two but the only major difference is that the ingredient list and this one is a bit you know uh, thick whereas this one a bit more runny in texture but this too when i use it on my face like i cannot recognize major difference instead of the texture everything seems so you know same uh, obviously the ingredients are not same where this is also a hybrid sunscreen and this is also hybrid sunscreen but if you if you have ever tried this one like this sunscreen used to be my favorite sunscreen um, but yeah this is not in my favorite list anymore this 
two are like really similar as it is winter and uh, I I don't like it for winter times because I like something more uh, moisturizing and for this my old good friend my almost favorite one sunscreen is the consist chemist sunscreen sunscreen this sunscreen is cream like it it doesn't feel heavy like it is everything that I want from a sunscreen it has ceramides and uh, I don't know I this is still my favorite sunscreen but for summer times in hot humid day this is the best if you have some allergy issue then do a patch test before trying it out because they have clearly mentioned here that some ingredients can trigger your allergy and i must say when i used it on on, a, on my very first day it kind of irritated my eye area a bit but right now i don't see like it doesn't irritate my eye area at all but initially it did irritate my eye area a bit but right now like i'm totally fine with it and if you are if you have fungal acne then please do a patch test because this is not fungal acne safe this is not allergy safe please do a patch test like you can take this take your sunscreen just like this okay take your sunscreen and apply it behind your ear okay uh, behind your ear and a bit around here and check if it does anything to you or not and if it doesn't do anything then voila you have found your soulmate and I want to say one thing to Ecologica that if I compare this sunscreen with the Japanese Nivea sunscreen the Japanese one comes in 100ml bottle whereas this one is 50 gram like don't do this I am so obsessed with this sunscreen that I cannot like find the piece if I buy the 50 gram one like launch a 100 gram version like I'm sick of buying it again and again so please just launch a 100 gram one so that we can enjoy it for a bit long time and uh, uh, there's this one thing that I want to say that for 50 gram you need to pay only 400 for this amazing texture but you're never paying 400 trust me like I when I got it it was like buy one get one sale in the Ecologica website I got it at flat 50% off and there are some sales that are buy to get to so you can get it as cheap as flat 50% discount what are you waiting for darling like you are getting a sunscreen in flat like in rupees 200 and that has so many qualities in it and that is even protecting you from blue rays yeah this is everything that you want right now and it is even cheaper than Nivea sunscreen so yeah, that's all for today. If you like this video, then don't forget to like this video, share this video. And if you try it out, don't forget to tell me. And if you are trying it out, don't forget to tell me. And if you if you have any more opinion about this product, let me know in my comment section. And uh, do subscribe to my channel. We are really close to 1K subscribers. And I cannot wait to see 1K subscribers on my channel. I am doing YouTube for a year. And uh, yeah. I just really want to reach 1k subscribers like I cannot believe that I'm doing YouTube for a year and I haven't get 1k subscribers yeah I know how you gonna feel I feel the same way I have bad luck but with you guys I'm gonna reach 1k in no time so subscribe to my channel and uh, click the bell icon and uh, my name is Vanna and I'll see you guys in the next video don't forget to drink a lot of water and uh, bye